from Northeast Wisconsin Technical College, Joseph Meyer. Good evening, everyone. First off, I need to say thank you to the people that have really helped me get to this point today in my life. It's been quite the bumpy road. However, my parents, my family have truly been my rock that have stuck by my side the entire time. Having family in your life is something that not everyone gets to have, and for me to have that is uh, truly special to me. I want to thank my program instructors at NWTC, Brian Guns and Justin Lemke. Uh, I've made great friendships with both of these two throughout the, throughout the entirety of my uh, time at NWTC, and they've been able to keep classes fun, interesting, and valuable uh, throughout the entire time. I want to thank Joe Richter, who is unfortunately not able to be here tonight, our coordinator at NWTC, and the rest of the selection committee uh, for giving me the opportunity to, resent, to represent this college uh, as this year's Student State Ambassador. Just two years ago, when I began at NWTC, I was in a pretty rough spot in life. I'd previously been attending UW-Madison for two years studying pre-engineering. While there, I was never quite able to get into the swing of things with the large classes of 250 kids and less personalization with the instructors. I'm a very personal person and I love making those relationships and really learning and making friendships all at the same time. Towards the end of my time there, I had also began dealing with some mental health issues. During the summer after my sophomore year, I was working extreme hours, going out with friends at nights, and not sleeping enough. This unfortunately led to extreme manic type behavior. And in not too long, my brain couldn't take it anymore. I had experienced psychosis. I had completely lost touch with reality. And I couldn't tell what was real and what wasn't in my mind. And for someone like me, who had always been the happiest person in the world and sure-minded, this was very extreme. I needed immediate medical help and I was hospitalized for 12 days and it was truly the scariest experience of my life. This was the point then when I knew I couldn't continue at UW-Madison and I needed to withdraw from the upcoming semester to focus on recovering. It took about two full months of intensive recovery at home until I was feeling closer to normal again. Not being able to work or go to school was extremely stressful, and I knew that I needed to start making a plan for once I was feeling good enough to get back into a routine. Leaving college and changing cities because of a medical issue was, someone that my, or was something that my optimistic self never thought could happen to me. In the fall of 2017, I was able to arrange a meeting in the month before school started with one of the mechanical design instructors at NWTC. He sat down with me on his own time, walked me through the entirety of the course competencies, and I knew right then and there that it truly would be a great fit. I was able to succeed instantly in the first semester while making new friends with my classmates. I was also able to secure an internship that first semester, which was another great learning opportunity to be able to work 25 hours a week in my field while attending school full time would never have been possible at a four year university. In the summer after my first year at NWTC, I found a new internship opportunity at Foth in Green Bay. There I began working on design projects for our clients, which are then installed in large scale industrial plants. I did not think I could find a career so quickly after everything that had happened that keeps me interested and motivated every day. I have now accepted a full-time job offer at Foth as a mechanical designer and cannot wait to get into the full-time workforce. I was also fortunate to participate in NWTC's study abroad program for the trades and engineering students. We spent 15 days in the state of Guanajuato, Mexico, soaking in the culture and learning extremely interesting things about high volume manufacturing plants. This is an experience that has affected me personally and professionally and that I'll remember for the rest of my life. I would, not be the, I would not be in the position I am today without NWTC, and I am proud to soon be an alumni. I believe that the technical college route is truly a fantastic choice, and my goal as state ambassador 
is to reach out to high school students as well as others to explain the benefits found through my personal experience. It's hard to know exactly what you want and need to do when you're 18 years old. And the Wisconsin Technical College System is a very, very smart way to transition into a college career. I'm confident that my education at NWTC has set me up with a great foundation for moving into the full-time workforce and to finish my bachelor's degree as well. Everyone has their struggles in life, but it's how you pick yourself up and keep moving forward that really counts. I thank NWTC and the WTCS system for all the opportunities that they've given me, and I greatly look forward to the next chapter in my life. Thank you.